around. Man. We need to be for real. Amen. We, we need some change in our life. We need, we need to think about everything changes. Everything around us changes, but our mind seems to stay yeah. the same. But Paul addressed the issue, didn't he? But Paul says, I beseech you, brethren, by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your reasonable service. There ain't no sacrifice. It's not so. That's your reasonable service. And be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. How many of you think like you've been thinking all your life? I'm just a country boy. I just think like that. <laughs> Come on now. Now, some folks think because they're in the country that God's word don't apply to them. Right. You know, the country is different from city. No, I think God's word is the same everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. everywhere. I, I go to the Christian books all the time. They ain't never seen no Bible say for country people. <laughs> all right. <laughs> if, you, if you live in the city less than 10,000, this Bible's for you. They yeah. ain't never seen it. And yet we, we seem to think that where we live has something to do with how we act. All right. I don't care what you didn't get when you were a kid. When I was a kid, they didn't have with two channels either. <laughs> but I sure can understand all them others. Amen. But we act like the way we grew up is the way we got to be. Why is that? Well, just the way they talk. Well, they need to teach you something else. You need to be learning something. Then you need, need to change, but your mind ain't got fixed. You don't want to. You don't want to change. Oh, no. All black people, all black people ain't nothing. Oh. And all Anglos ain't nothing. All <laughs> Hispanics ain't nothing. It, it, it's what they are individually, right. just like what you are individually. It don't matter what your mama and them was. <laughs> 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 yeah, I hear mean, people tell me all the time, your own them cars was that way. No, they ain't. <laughs> I got five brothers, and ain't none of us alike. All right. None. They may look alike, but that, that's where it stops. And when you get to looking at them, they don't all look alike. We make them look alike because we know they brothers. Yeah, I can tell that. <laughs> because they don't look alike. They might have some features that's alike. But they do not only twins and triplets and stuff, and some of them don't look alike. Oh, but we want to think just because where we came from someplace, we supposed to be, we can justify the way we act. You need yeah. to change. All right now. It doesn't yeah. matter when you went to jail the first time. You need to change. Amen. <laughs> it don't matter how many times you've been in rehab. You need to change. change. And I don't care how many times you got your butt whooped and you ain't got learned nothing, you need to change. Need to be for real. All right. We're living in a false world. Yes, yes. God said, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. All things. If I can do all things, why is it that I cannot get out and make myself a living? All right. I can do all things through Christ. Yeah. Why, why is it that I can't hold my hold my tongue? Why, why is it that my every time I think about something, I want to kill somebody? <laughs> you need to change your mind. You need to have your mind renewed all right. through Christ Jesus. Been living that lie too long, thinking I'm all right. Just because you got to be sixty, don't make you all right. Come on. You lucky somebody to kill you, but oh, right. you you won't. God just took, God just been protecting us. Yes, yes. He's been taking care of us, but we think we did something. All right. I made it this far. <laughs> <laughs> it, it work in the street. It all work in the church. <laughs> Y'all know I'm right. When you come to church, you bring the same mindset that you had in the street to the church house. That's why we get mad at each other. We don't, we don't buy that turn of the cheek stuff. All right. <laughs> we, we don't buy that at all. You do something now, I'm do something you back. That's just, that's just the way I'm raised. <laughs> Amen. And young folk think that they were taught to not pay attention in church. Why that get from you ain't never paid attention. Why don't you start paying some attention? Might benefit you. Amen. You don't know. But we come to church and, and young folk, and I ain't trying to bother the young people. But the truth of the matter is, 
They think they hear out of some obligation to somebody. Mm -hmm. If you don't get it here, what you get is out in the world, mm -hmm. and the world don't care nothing about no. you. No. Right. Zero. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, I can make it out there. Yeah, that, that's why they got so many prisons. Because you're making it out there. Amen. That's why we got so many folk. We got these new terms. See? My baby mama. And my <laughs> <laughs> my baby daddy, they, they, you know, they ain't making it. You, you were making it, that'd be my, my husband and my child's father. And, you know, but you ain't making it. You ain't making it. You, but making it for now, they, they think we're figuring out how to get on welfare and get some, get some what is that, Lone Star. Get me a Lone Star card. I'm making it. I just got to figure out how to keep it. Amen. And I'm real. That's what it is. We, getting over is making it. Now making it is getting out there and taking care of yourself. Building you a life so that at some point in time you'll be able to sit down and enjoy the fruits of all your labor. To whatever to whatever degree that you can do that. You don't want to get to be 65 and still got to work. 12, 14 hours a day. Mm -hmm. Ain't got nothing. Mm -hmm. What's that saying? Ain't got a pot to. Amen. But you making it. <laughs> no, we, 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 we need to get real. You know, we've been, we've been living in this false world too long. So some of us, it's too late to go start over again. Yeah. You understand? We, we didn't do it. <laughs> Nobody didn't tell us we needed to do it, Amen. and now we are where we are. But it don't you, you ain't gonna go back and change your economic status now because you ain't working no more, maybe. But you can so change the effect of life on you by changing your mind. You understand? You don't get the five hundred and fifty dollars a month. You cannot buy no car with three hundred dollar payment. <laughs> I don't care how much food stamps and you get. It don't matter. You can't do it. You need some public transportation and government housing. That's a fact. That's a fact. You get to be 55 or 60, you can't take out no 30-year mortgage. <laughs> If it ain't paid for, it ain't gonna get paid for. It. And you know that. Amen. You need to be real. Amen. All right. And if you were young, you'd start over preparing for them days. Of, you can't live with mom and dad forever. I know some of y'all think, well, mom will come back. I leave. Mom might not leave you. you know? Amen. All right. All right. And with these reverse mortgages, when they do die, you ain't you gonna owe them folk more than what the house is worth. Amen. I know you play, but but that ain't happening. Because if I need some money, my kids ain't getting nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna live. <laughs> and I plan on living another 35, 40 years. Amen. And I'm gonna run out of money in 10, so I <laughs> <laughs> But I'm realistic too. I'm not gonna live another five years if I don't take care of myself. Right. If I don't do what the doctor say, I don't have to like it do. I don't like now one of them pills I put in my mouth anymore. I don't like none of them, but it don't matter. I get me a glass of water, put them all in my hand, and slap them in my mouth, and wash them down. Don't make no difference. I don't like no shots, but I shoot myself twice a day, every day, with that with insulin. <coughs> But I like it. <laughs> and trust me, it took me a while for me to get real. But when I became diabetic, doctor told me I was diabetic. I don't think I went to the doctor for 10 years. <laughs> Same medicine he prescribed when I was diabetic. I was still taking it. Then one day I woke up and couldn't see out of my right eye. Oh, you should have saw me beating the door down. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the specialist and I said, man, you need to see something about this. And they ran all them $500 worth of tests that I had to pay for myself. Amen. The insurance didn't cover it. But I had to pay that out of pocket before they had told me that I was right. not going to get it back. They said, well, that's a common thing, but you ain't getting that out of that. I said, what? I went to my other doctor. He said, well, 
Now, the man that I'm gone, he said, well, let's not worry about it. Let's worry about that other one. <laughs> I'm being real. <laughs> 